day ladies and gentlemen you are welcome today to this video tutorial brought to you by Dewpoint Graphics and sponsored by Dewpoint Graphic Academy today in this video tutorial we are going to be designing this amazing food flyer so kindly follow the video tutorial carefully so at the end of the day we shall all arrive at this amazing design but please if you need um, the resources to this particular design kindly check in the description below I'll be leaving a link that will help you to get access to these resources and also if this is the first time you are coming across this particular channel kindly do well to click on the subscribe button and also turn on the notification button to be notified whenever we drop amazing videos like this without Without wasting my time, let's touch. Let's start from scratch. Now, um, first thing first, we are going to set up our our designing area, and we are going to be using a square, which is um, Instagram post. So you click on it, and then it's going to lead you to your working space like this. Now, um, the first thing we are going to do is to work on the background. We need to get our background first. Then, um, after that, we can upload whatever designs or um, sorry resources, whatever resources. Now, um, first of all, you need to come to gallery or you come to camera roll. Some of you are having camera roll. And others are showing gallery right so you click on it then you select that particular background so you're going to select this right then you add to page now this is how it is showing so you're going to place it at the top left corner here then you increase the size a bit to close this section then you click and hold on it then you lock it up and the next thing we are going to do is to come to elements then you click on elements we are going to choose um, a shape which is a square shape so with a square shape you bring it down here and you regulate it to the size of um, a rectangle then you come to color section then you give it a red color give it a red color so you click and hold on it too then you lock it up right so that is the first thing you have to do uh, which has to do with locking uh, sorry create which has to do with um, the background and the next thing we are going to do is we are going to add the text so you come to text you click on text you click on add a heading so with the heading you edit it then you write testy testy so testy you bring it here you increase the size of it now you come to font the font you are going to be using here we call the font April fat face so when you are not finding it you use the search button then you select you search April fat face and this is what you are going to see here right so testy then you place it here the next thing you come and click on you come to uh, elements then you click on elements you are going to select a circular shape a circular shape so with the shape you bring it here then you reduce the size of the circle like this now if the circle becomes small sometimes it is difficult moving it so you can use this to move it like this get it then you give it a color so you come to color section then you give this a red color now 
now the next thing is you come to text again then you add a text so you can add a heading then you write the end so you're using this end sign here um, you are using it so you reduce the size a bit right so um, the color we are going to assign to this is white so you come to color section they you give it a white color so when you give it a white color um, the next thing we are going to be doing here uh, you add another text so you click on the testy you can just click on the testy then you copy the text then you place it down here then you edit the text then you write delicious tasty and delicious now the delicious you reduce the size uh, something like this it's not bad then you change the color to red right you change it to red tasty and delicious pizza so you can just you can click on the tasty again then you copy it then you bring it down here then you edit it then you write pizza pizza now you reduce the size of the pizza then you bring it down here make sure you reduce the size of the pizza right so the next thing is just to import other resources so you click on camera roll you are going to select um, this leaf then you add to page so this is the leaf you see that it is appearing with a black background so you wait a bit and then you see the bag the black background is going to go off now we are going to rotate this we're going to be using this particular um, thing here to rotate the um, to rotate this particular leaf so you're going to hold it like this then you rotate it this way you get it so um, you make sure you hold here then you reduce the size sorry sorry then you place it over here you place now um do well to rotate it carefully so that you don't have issues something like this it's not bad like this it's not bad right so you can place it that way then you lock it up remember to always lock up your elements so that you will not be um, having issues with it right so the next thing we are going to do is to import our pizza and with the pizza we add to page like this right you see it's also coming with this particular background so you wait a bit and the background is going to go off then you increase the size a bit increase the size a bit now let me move this particular leaf back so I'm going to move it to the back a bit like this so that let me reduce the size place it here right so that is it for this here so you increase the size then you place it well bring it down here right so the next thing we are going to do is to add uh, another resource which is a leaf like this then you click to add to page now um you wait a bit so that the black background goes off now you're going to place it here like this right
cards something like this and that is great and the next thing we just add um, call to tax which is order now so by adding text so you come to text you click on text we add a, a header now you're going to edit it then you write now the next thing we're going to do is we come to shapes so you come to shapes here um, elements then you click you use this same um, uh, shape here so you click on it then you reduce its size like this so you can reduce the size here now you can see that it's not visible so let's change the color to white like this then we place it down here right yes something like this is great then we can add order now a text so you click on text then click on add a heading then you edit it then write order now order now so you reduce the size of the text then you place it here then we are going to give the text a font known as um this so you search for this and this is it i'm going to get it here right so we are changing the order now the color to red yeah so we want some color coding to be there so we can change it to red now the next thing is to add our contacts and also some delivery so you can just click on camera roll so I'm going to upload this here so with this I'm just going to reduce the size bring it down here then you change the color you change the color to white but you can also choose to leave the color like that so let's allow it just for the sake of not wasting my time on this particular design right so you can come to text now then you add a text you add a text now with the text we are adding our contact info that we are cool to go so I can decide to leave the text color like this but I could also change the color to white just to make it look okay then the next thing is to add a delivery icon and with this I can reduce the size here right then I can copy on uh, I can click on the text of this contact then I click on copy then I bring it down here then I edit it then uh, we deliver deliver to your doorstep so something like this and I'm already done with my design so that is it for this particular design here yeah, very easy to design and um, a very great design for that matter right so you can just do this and then you are good to go right so when you are done you just click on this particular button here to save your design that is where we normally click to save the design 
right and when it is saved it goes to your gallery directly right so thank you very much guys for watching this video tutorial please don't forget to subscribe and also click on the notification button to be notified whenever we drop amazing videos like this thank you very much see you in the next